new video, new prints. I found some cool printing ideas which can be useful as well. The first one is this cool pencil case. The main part is printed with filament chains mid print. I used the filament chain script but I did it little bit too late so there are some layers of silver which should be yellow. All three pieces are threaded together, the threads are all nicely done and I had no problems. This case has good size and looks cool. If you need some nice decoration with use of future, why not to print it? I printed all parts together, first you need to clean the prints. There are some mouse hairs looking parts for better adhesion. Two pieces are put together with one long pin which didn't want to fit in place. Some hammer work and I managed to do it. Next pieces didn't want to fit also. Don't know if my printer cost it or the model tolerances are too tight. So to get it fit and slide smoothly I sanded both pieces and also added some grease to get it moving more smoothly. If you want to print it yourself, PLA filament is not recommended. The heat in car can make it softer and weaker. I added these mounting clips before I added grease. This is the XL version of the bone holder. There are available smaller one also. It mounts directly to the car air vents. My phone fits nicely and is strongly in place. This print needs some supports and prim removing, which came off fine. The model grader also included pictures with cura settings. Assembly is easy, all parts you need is 3D printed except 2 M3 volt. Before we attach lead, you need to mount it on the wall because screw holes will be blocked. I used this piece of wood plate just to see how it works if it's mounted to the wall. Chasing the roll is easy and takes no time. If you don't have 3D printer but you need something to 3D print, just type in pcbweight.com and start ordering your stuff. There are many different types of 3D printing you can choose from. Different materials, PCBWay also makes custom PCBs. They provide CNC milling series, sheet metal fabrication and injection molding. Ordering is very easy, upload your File, select units, material, color. You can choose different surface finish if you like prototyping and making cool projects. This is cool place to buy custom parts. If you want to simple and minimalistic Xbox One controller stand, then it's the right thing to do it in. I use three color seal PLA and it shines very nice. The handle didn't came out uh, as it should, I didn't add it add support, I cut off the excess material and it came out fine. This drawer is designed for flat bottom desk but I want to put it on the shelf so I designed some brackets for that. I also drilled holes bigger because I wanted to use bigger screws. The back of the rail bent a little bit so we added some spaces later. It is nice and useful drawer to hold your smaller things organized. It's a print in place box with a lead. I printed it with 200 mm per second and because that the quality isn't the best. Next thing to, to do is break loose the lead. It's the scary thing to do because something might break. I was lucky and nothing broke. 
The lead lock in base was little bit too tight, so I got some material off. Simple calib caliper case with lead, it's easy to print and my caliper fit nicely inside. If I shake it up and down it moves, but side to side it don't. Last print is a Goosey, which has drink counting feature. Gooseys can hold your drink holder a little bit longer and your hand will warm your drink less. At first the lead didn't want to screw on, but after some drying I got it moving much better. Also counting ring didn't want to move smoothly. Some sanding will fix it. There could be a little bit less height so the can will not move up and down. When the can is empty, take it out and then turn counting ring to the next number and add another can. So you will remember how many cans you have had, but it will work only if you remember to turn the counting ring. And that's all for this video, thanks for watching.